Things never go to plan, but it's always fun to try. <laughs> well, hello everybody. My name is Lindsay and we're gonna do some decluttering today. It's gonna be great. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe down below because we are a growing family and we love each other very much here. So if, if you like being here, join our family. It's a lot of fun. It's Vlogmas day seven. It's been so fun. It's the sixth for me, but I, I'm posting this on the 7th, so. Installment of <laughs> advent calendar stuff. Me and Dan had a pretty lazy morning. I mean, not lazy for me necessarily, because I was editing all morning, all morning, and he was kind of just playing and watching shows and just kind of doing his own thing. And he really did do his own thing, because we were going to go do the advent calendar this, this afternoon before his nap, but he already took it upon himself to open one of the presents. <laughs> this is supposed to be for Advent Day 9. And well, he gets it one like a few days early. So I'm just going to switch Day 9 and Day 7. So, or Day 6, sorry. Yeah, because today's the 6th. <laughs> day 9 and Day 6. That one is a activity so that will work out I'm just taking this one out because he's already used it so <laughs> oh. things never go to plan but it's always fun to try <laughs> so he got his little orange car today and he was loving it playing with it it was probably a good thing that he got a little toy instead of doing an activity because i was we were just so busy so it worked out for today it was kind of naughty of him but it's okay <laughs> He's two. Um, anyway, so we're gonna go downstairs. Well, what I wanna do is go through baby stuff. There's a lot of baby stuff that I, I'm just like in that zone, you know? I'm in that like mental zone. I'm 16 weeks pregnant, almost 17. Not quite, 16 and a half weeks pregnant. Yeah, it's just, it's been great, but I'm starting to get into like that nesting mentality, which isn't amazing, but. <laughs> But it also is, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but anyway, I'm wearing a new Christmas, not new, but like a different Christmas sweater today. I, but I have this sweater and <laughs> let me know if you know what it's from. It says, don't blink. And then there's angels. And then there's like these robots and a phone box. Um, and then it says delete, delete, delete. And it's got more robots down there, so. I will give you a hint. They're not just robots, they're also aliens. So if you know what it's from, please comment it down below. It's fun to see if you guys know. I was a big fan of this show. I still love it, but it's not like something I watch anymore. But yeah, let's go downstairs. But I need my cup first. Um, okay, so let's scoot that over. I need to just move everything out of the way that's not baby stuff. I'm not dealing with this kind of stuff today. Everything on this side of the closet is baby stuff and it's a little overwhelming and I have a dog sitting next to me trying to get have, trying to make me give her attention. Pack and play, definitely keeping that. We still use that for Dan like when we go out of town and stuff for for any reason that we need to. Okay so this is box of three month stuff. I just kind of like like three to six months, sorry, I have to read the green tags. It says three months up here, up here, but three to six months. This might be okay for just that many, like that size. It's the bigger boxes that are full of different sizes that might be, I don't know. I'm like, I like don't wanna go through each box though. I just, I think I need to organize this in here and go through the bins that I need to go through and go through the older size like this bin right here. This bin has all the clothes that I pulled out of Dan's room that's either out of season, so I'll pull it back out once he's um, out of the season, or, which I might just put a box in his room that has those clothes, or it was, he's too too big for them. Like, the clothes are too small. This is the newborn box. So I think I'm gonna keep this and the three month one, or the three to six month one right there. I know there's a zero to three month in here somewhere, but there's also like this bin down here, 
which is full of these are all bottles for breast milk and so I have a hard time like giving those away and then these are the bottles that we used so I also have a hard time giving those away I don't know guys like there's some things in here that I'm gonna struggle with giving anything away I think like little blankets and burp cloths and little things in here like this stuff is great stuff. Like, I don't know. I don't know if I need this much of it though, is the thing. So it's just, it's hard. Um, these little pads that you put on top of your diaper changing pad so that you don't have to change your diaper changing pad so much. You just like change that out. A little cloud pillow. This I could probably declutter actually. I don't think I need that. My breast pump which I mean I don't know I don't want to keep it because I don't need it <laughs> um, another bottle Roxy what are you doing uh, diaper changing pad or like a whatever it is like a little cover I was gonna do like a little um, teepee theme for Dan's room but I don't think I don't think I need this so these two things I think I'm going to declutter my little microwavable um, bottle, whatever it is. It's a bottle steamer, so it, like, it disinfects the bottles. Okay, so I did pull a couple things out that I am willing to part with, but like, how do you just, how do you get rid of all this stuff? But I mean, someone could probably use them, so. I am gonna declutter my breast pump. I don't know if anyone will want it, but I'm gonna declutter it. And this bottle, I didn't really love these bottles, so I'll say no to that. I just, I'm having a tough time with this bag of storage bottles. I don't know why. I think maybe though, so it's like, it's like these little bottles that you put breast milk in. I washed them all, they're all clean. They probably have some water spots on them and stuff, but. They're all clean, I just have a bunch of them. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna declutter this. I'm just gonna keep this one bag of these bottles just cause I did like these. And they were really easy to use and you just, they're really easy for like early stages. And then I'm gonna declutter these. I have one unopened package of them. I'll keep that and that's, probably good okay I feel better about that and then I'm gonna do and then I'm gonna, gonna declutter this whole bag of these bottles I'm probably gonna go through it and put lids on all of them someone might need them and then it saves a ton of room in this container so that I can add things for a baby that I want to keep um, in a bin that's not just loose anymore so that does clear that out of quite a bit oh look a shoe. a shoe I'm pretty sure I don't remember if I found the other match to that but I'm gonna put that in this bin right here for now okay I need to pull down these boxes don't need that right now oh but that is where my nipple pads are so my nipple pads are in there and then I have some Actually, I will put these in here. It's like my nursing bras and things. I'll just throw those in there and then I can get rid of this box. That's great. This stuff does make me a little anxious to like go through. Okay, um, there's a box. One, there's actually two little boxes over here. Baby boy shoes and socks. So yeah, I'll just, I'll keep all that together I guess I don't know it's this is hard stuff guys I don't want to go through everything I just want to make sure I don't have too much of things so I guess I guess this part is like me seeing what I have and then I need to go through the bigger stuff um just so I'm not overwhelmed with all of Dan's older sizes like there's a ton of clothes like this is 18 to 24 months do I actually need that many 18 to 24 months clothes probably not so 
Sorry, one second. My mom is calling me, so I probably ought to answer that really quick. Hi, mom. Let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach without freezing. Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times, we'll be chilling and having a good So, I was kind of going through stuff, not really. <laughs> I was talking to my mom. But, so. I put a blanket in there, one that I want to keep, and then I pulled this bin out, and it had some shoes and some hats in here and some pictures that I need to put somewhere else, probably. Aww, Look our little family. That was one of the first. That was the first picture we took of all of us, actually. Oh, my little pregnant belly. Someone else is calling me. My mom? Oh, not my sister. <laughs> oh, okay, one second. <laughs> out while I was on the phone with my sister and then now I'm overwhelmed <laughs> I think that's the majority of it so I have the car seat over here it's very dusty it's been in this closet since Dan was like what like eight months old nine months old I don't remember maybe he was even a year old when we no he wasn't a year old in this thing was he I have no idea I'd have to look at when we bought it and then I was also given this second base. I actually don't know if it fits, so I should probably make sure before I store it again. <laughs> but I was given that, and I'm hoping it'll fit the one, this one, because then we can have two bases and just have, just put it back and forth between the cars. How do you like, oh, isn't it the two sides? That's for the arms. I don't remember how to do this. How do you do it? Oh, it's on the back. There you go. <laughs> and then I wanted to see if it fits in this other base. Roxy's very interested. Yep, it fits. So I have two bases, which is fantastic. And that way we can put one in Devin's truck and one in my car. Once we have the little munchkin, that'll be awesome. What else am I doing? <laughs> I don't even know. I'm gonna put these back where they were though. And funny story, I have some little girl clothes because, well, I used to nanny girls and I saved some that I just loved. And then I also, um, like this little outfit. I just loved it. It's kind of an older one. Like it's for like a four year old, I'm pretty sure. But I just, I loved it so much, I kept it. Don't ask me why. <laughs> like little leggings, some shirts, but like I also bought some things at like yard sales and, and at the thrift store, like this little jumper. So if we are having a girl, I 
have some clothes <laughs> that I have been saving for her. Um, if we're ever blessed with a little girl, maybe I will be able to use these for her for that wonderful day when we get to have a girl. But if this is a boy, I have a lot of clothes. And I mean a lot of clothes <laughs> that we can save, that we can use for this next baby if it's a boy. So I have this box of shoes and hats that I need to kind of like sort through and see where they go. I don't know. It's hard with shoes because I don't know what boxes to put it in. So maybe I just need another box for like just shoes. Um, and then I have a box of toys over here. And the thing is, do I want to like go through any of this stuff or do I just want to organize it? I might just be wanting to organize it. Crafty, that's not for you. And then, and then maybe in a future video, I'll go through all of these boxes again. I did it in a video probably how many months ago? Like probably March is when I did it last. And I just went through just to kind of do that first layer of decluttering. It was a huge layer. There were so many clothes. I had to sort all of them and it was just, it was a lot of work mentally. I was drained. I need to pull this out. I bought this at a thrift store and I really like it. I, I really like it for a baby room, but I'm trying to decide if I want to keep it until then or if I just, I don't know. I, I didn't find a use for it in Dan's room. And I haven't really been able to find a use for it anywhere else. It doesn't really make sense to have it in any other room other than like a baby's room. But I really like it. So maybe I'll just stick it in here for now and I'll, I'll declutter it if I feel like it's necessary at some point in time. This box is pretty much completely full. I mean, it's, it's like there because I just put another thing in it and it's pretty full. So I filled this up with blankets and... Um, there was a couple more bottles and then a few more things. So I do want to go through that again at some point. The toys, I don't know. Maybe I'll just like leave these down here and let Dan play with them when he's down here. Leave them out because he likes to play with them, but he doesn't need them upstairs. So, but I don't want to pack them in here. I felt like it was really crowded in here. So I think I'm going to have a little corner for playing in here for Dan once I get it a little bit more cleared out. We'll see. And then this is the baby bath seat that I have. I really like it. I think it's Angel Care. Yep. Angel Care and the, the bassinet is right here. And I really like that one too. It's really nice. Box of baby toys. I don't want Dan getting into this though. But I think there's some more toys I need to put in here from this bin over here. Let's tilt you down a little bit. So there's this bin that we just went through Dan's room. Found some toys that he wasn't playing with or toys that I wanted to save. Um, so I'm going to make, I think I'm going to have a box for just sandal, like shoes and shoes and hats that I can just stick all of them in and not worry about that kind of stuff. But I think the rest of these are all clothes. I don't think there's any more toys in here because I did the clothes first. So I think that would be the first thing. So the toys are done, I think. So I'll just tuck this underneath the bassinet. Okay. And then this bin, this box. Oh, yeah, there's the other shoe. Cool. <laughs> this box has some snow boots, like the ones that don't fit him anymore. Like this is a size six and this one was a size seven and he's like a size nine now so great so i'll do like a bin of socks shoes and hats and then i need to find a box for it but yeah that'll be good and then oh my gosh i'm just like it makes me so sad that he's growing out of he's grown out of all of this stuff it's crazy there's more shoes <laughs> So many shoes. So I need, I think these ones are smaller than those ones. Well, I mean, they definitely are because I, I decluttered this stuff a lot earlier than that stuff. Okay, so shoe bin, but I'm going to have to find another one because that's not going to work. A coat, which I'm trying to decide if I should just like have a winter gear box, like 
totally like just have a winter gear box that I can throw things in but I don't know <laughs> I haven't decided yet okay so this stuff will probably let's see what sizes these are so this one is 2t which huh okay well interesting I decluttered that probably just because it seemed really small on him so we don't have a 2t box yet but we're gonna need one because he's grown out of the 2t stuff I can't believe he's like in size 3t now it makes me very sad this is also 2t so I just need to find I mean that means that these are probably all 2t like a lot of these are 2t too 2t2 um two yeah I did love having these though, not gonna lie. I wish they made these in a bigger size. 24 months, so I'm gonna put this with the 18 to 24 month box. Why do I keep losing the shirts for the make the Cookie Monster things? Wait, was that? Wait, it was, isn't that the same one? Yes, it is, okay. So I just had the, sh the shirt in this one and I just had the pants in that one, okay, great. Okay, 2T pair of jammies. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of start through these really quick so I, that you don't have to sit and listen to me talk forever because that's boring. <laughs> and this can go away. Let's just belong here. So I found three things I, I'm happy to part with right there. This is the new 2T bin. Not sure if I'm gonna need a bigger one than that, but that is the one for that for now. And so, great. This is the stuff I'm just gonna put back in Dan's room. So that'll feel good when it's done. This can go in the closet right here though. And yeah, it's piled to the ceiling. <laughs> so high. Okay, I need to find something to put this stuff in that I can use. All fit in this box, at least some of them will. Um, but yeah, let's see. I just do that <laughs> and then I find a better box for this later that sounds good to you cool because I don't think if I let that go it'll um, be anything good so I'm just gonna do this for now and it's just it's gonna be just fine um but this is what it looks like it is better because I know what's in here 
these are all the clothes and I do want to go through them again especially the 18 to 24 month box because it's very full I was able to declutter three things from there and then I'm taking out the toys so that Dan can use them so I've got these things this bag of things maybe we'll sit and we'll put all that together my pump I don't know what to do with a pump though and then this little pillow that Roxy thinks is hers Roxy do you want this toy do you want it come get it come here come on grab it I think we found a new toy for Roxy she's gonna tear it apart in five seconds <gasps> go get it yeah that's, those are the best kinds of toys, the ones that you weren't planning to grab for your dog. The ones you didn't buy and the ones that you don't have to think about. <laughs> okay, so I, I think we should go through all these bottles and find, make sure they all have lids and then just throw away the ones that don't have lids. It's tied really tight. <laughs> Goodness, Lindsay, why do you tie it so tight? How do I open this? Because I want to use the bag again. <laughs> Just to put them all back into. I don't want to break the bag. Yeah, I think I think I made a good choice in giving that to Roxy. She's loving it. Roxy, get your new toy. Um, I'm waiting for some chicken to thaw out for dinner. So that's kind of why I decided to do some decluttering. Because Dan's napping. I could have taken a nap. I did think about it. I do have kind of a headache. But, I, but I'm also like, if I take a nap, I won't be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> So I've been trying to not take naps, but I could easily take a nap and I should grab my water because I do have a headache, but it's okay. garbage. Roxy just st stole one of the bottles and I'm sure she'll destroy it but th it didn't have a lid so I don't feel bad about that. I'll recycle the rest. So there, I don't know how many there were but maybe I'll post these on like because I feel weird just like sending them to a donation center so maybe I'll just post these on like Facebook marketplace or something. Do you have anyone wants them? I haven't, I don't know. I don't know if anyone would want them but maybe i mean they're nice it's just a bunch of bottles that you can put baby food in, like baby milk in like your breast milk um and then my breast pump as well and there's a couple of those bottles in here as well but i don't know that one i don't know if i can i don't know if i can like give that away what do you what do you do with a breast pump i don't know and then these, these are all going to go into my pile of stuff to declutter. Um, but yeah, I feel good. I feel like I did a pretty good job. No, I wasn't. I didn't do a perfect job. No, most of today was just trying to make sure I knew what I had. Well, I feel good about what I did, even though, no, I didn't get a lot done. I didn't even declutter very much, but I know what I have. I know what I need, or kind of. I still will need to go through it again. <laughs> Probably a few more times. Like, not gonna lie, a lot more times, I'm sure. Even just seeing, even just like parting with this stuff, this is a big step, okay? <laughs> I need to take a tri trip to the donation center soon, but Minion is scratching at the door trying to get Devin to let him out, even though Devin's not here. 
so make that make sense, Minion? He's being so weird. I don't know. He's just, he wants Devin. There's a lot more to declutter. This room needs a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton of work. The closet was the part that was bugging me the most. There's a whole other side of the closet still, but this was the part that I think it was bugging me the most because I know I need to do it. But yeah, so we'll, we'll see. <laughs> But doing these declutter videos through December has been really awesome. I don't do one every day because that would be a lot. But I do I do, do them pretty often, so it's kind of nice. Oh man, anyway, I love you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Know that I love you and know that I will be back tomorrow. <laughs> and I guess that's it. I love you guys. I've already said I love you like 10 times. It never stops being true, but <laughs> might get annoying. <laughs> I will see you in the next video. Bye. I guess I'm gonna go put these away. <laughs>